trouble in the palace following the demise of the Alafi of Oyo Obala Media Deyemi the third as ex-queen Damilola and her mother were disgraced out of the palace. In fact, walked out of the palace with a lot of booing among others happening to them. Let's get right into the gist, guys. Welcome to this channel. Recall that on the 23rd of April 2022, sadness enveloped most of the Yoruba kingdom because one of the most paramount rulers and the longest serving Alafi of Oyo or Balamidi Adeyemi III passed on and since then traditional rites have commenced to ensure that he gets a smooth ride to dining with his ancestors having wood for 52 years. Now the purpose of this gist is Queen Damilola, one of the ex-wives of the um, late Alafi of Oyo. The thing is this, when the Alafi was alive, he had about 18 wives, but I know of course 13 of them publicly. Of those 13, three of these young wives, one of the junior wives actually left him you know to start living their lives outside of the palace and it seemed like well all is well for them because Ikubaba Yeye as the Alafin was called was bound to live for a very long time however sadly he you know passed on sooner than the world expected following that one of the wives who left the palace Queen Damilola returned to the palace open to get a bit of the spoiling and the properties that of course the king is going to leave behind because the thing is now that the alafin has died um his wives the queens have to leave the palace properties that the alafin owned when he was alive would be shared among them and according to even a palace chief they are free now to go marry other men because typically in yoruba kingdom they are um, expected to get a ritual bathing and among other things you know some cleansing for them to be able to mate with other men but said that these women are free to go mingle in a society but of course properties will be shared with them which is what informed queen damilola's return to the palace however that was not met well with a lot of persons in the palace you could hear one of the queens asking and shouting and, and saying what are you here to do she was speaking in yoruba so i'm going to translate for you the video was about a minute long and she was saying what are you here to do now that the king is dead you are happy abby you think you can now works in here and do what you want and just come in here with your mother and think all is well after i ridiculed the king while he was alive among other things so why is this particular queen living with queen damlola when queen damlola left the palace you know before her queen ola already left the palace you know queen anu left the palace but queen damlola's you know living of the palace was one that was really controversial because she came on blogs and said terrible things concerning the palace saying that herself and her mom were chased out of the palace because the queen what the king wanted to marry a friend who she introduced to the palace because that said friend had problems in her home among other things she also said that when she was made to leave the palace she she they didn't let her leave her quarters in the palace with anything but the clothes she was wearing behind the back even her twin boys were left you know stranded she's stranded she's caught with somebody she's homeless she has no money on her her mom is sick blah 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 she said a lot of things and so nigerians were moved they donated money gave her things so she could rent an apartment etc etc however queen damlola took a turn and came to publicly apologize to the palace and to the king saying that she wants to return to the palace she's sorry she said those things she's sorry she came to publicly solicit for funds among other things but that did not even face the late king because he did not allow her back into the palace and she's been living her life outside of the palace and we thought that was the end of it only for her to hear about the king's demise and for her to return to the palace hoping to get a bit of the spoils of the king and for and you can understand why the you know palace aides and the queens are angry in fact by extension you know bullet eats the other queens that left the, the junior queens already left because the queen mother could be heard saying i don't know if that's the queen mother speaking but the certain queen i was speaking could be heard saying that well not only is queen dam lola the only person not welcome the remaining junior wives that left queen anu and queen ola are not welcome in the palace they can return to wherever they are and they shouldn't come back open to get anything i'm going to list some of the you know wives of the king for you the the ones that we know of course well it was her life and um, from the person that has been with him since 1971 actually his first two wives were gifted to him when he got when he got um coronated he ascended the thrones of his fathers on the 18th of november 1970 and he got two women with him they are queen rahmat adedayo and queen mojidat adeyemi 
now i'm going to continue naming other wives that you welcomed queen rukaya adeyemi queen afolasha adeyemi queen badira adeyemi adeyemi queen memuno uh mwawo me adeyemi queen mwabalani adeyemi queen muji adeyemi queen anu luwa adeyemi then queen damilola adeyemi and of course um after queen damilola left he welcomed another woman um queen chioma adeyemi and that would make him the first alafin to marry outside of the yoruba tribe because of course the queen the king likes every tribe and every person is not a tribalistic person this is just me saying anyways um following that queen damilola has been sent out of the palace and is booing for returning and trying to take anything the blogger that even broke the news had a lot of things to say including how um other women also have been told to not come to the palace in their own words they said queen damilola of your kingdom and her mother disgraced out of the palace yesterday queen damilola the lady way all of our last nation contributed money for that time they completed the public apology for by telling her say the public apology after that same then no accept her back where she was at the palace with her mom yesterday and her bus was the matter take end you can see in the visual above one of the bad people warning all the junior wives that left the palace before baba passed on says she no one see them for palace even bad dira quinola say if then show face now flying broken bottles go meet their head the lady talk say she be they don't happy now as a guy don't die she make them keep moving it keep it moving no we'll go settle this matter by more drama to unfold in the next couple of days of course more dramas will happen in the next couple of days and i'm going to be here to give you all the tea so you need to click on the bell icon that is going to happen only after you subscribe there's a bell icon you need to click on so you get all notifications and you won't meet miss hot just like this one when it happens and situations unfolding following the demise of the king who was 83 years at the time of death he died at the afebabala university after battling illness and it was even according to reports said that plane tickets had already been procured for not just the king but some of his wives to accompany him to get you know better medical treatments outside of the country since it seemed like he wasn't getting better before he sadly passed on one of the women in the palace also said that baba said it two weeks ago that he could see his own father call him to come to the land yonder and it's just sad that the king anu accepted that call and is now no more and no longer with us i want to hear from you guys in the comment section let me know what you think concerning this is it right that these queens return to the palace i mean they have children for the king so is it right that they return to the palace and try to get a bit of the spoils a bit of their inheritance and property in the palace or since you already said goodbye to the king while he was alive there is no reason for them to come but no provision should be made for them i know now that the king is dead i want to hear from you in the comment section please subscribe to this channel if i had to do that like this video leave a comment and share it to everyone around you i'll see you in the next video bye